expressing the gratitude and also uh, with the executives and all of you here, I would like to just brief about our institutions and especially focusing on the graduation ceremony. Yes. Graduation ceremony 2022. The world's big things only can be done by paying attention to their humble beginnings. Dear friends, as we are preparing for the graduation ceremony, which will be held on 2nd of April at 10 a.m. in Fatamullah Convention Center, and on this occasion, today we especially remember our founder, Reverend Father Augustus Mullah, by paying a tribute of respect and honor to him. For the last two years, due to the pandemic, we could not organize the graduation ceremony in a big way. Now this year, as you all know, we are organizing this in a grand manner. The chief guest for this program will be Dr. Geetanjali Batman Ben, Pro Vice Chancellor of Geeta University of Medical Sciences, Vizag, and former director all India Institute of Medical Sciences, Bhuvaneshwar. Honorable Justice John Michael Dikuna, former judge of the High Court of Karnataka, will be the guest of honor. Most Reverend Dr. Peter Paul Saldana, Bishop of Mangalore Diocese and also the President of Madhavala Charitable Institutions, will be presiding over the function. Around 12,000 people consisting of graduates, postgraduates, faculty, parents and guests will be witnessing this celebration. We have totally 615 graduates from various educational units of Padamalla charitable institutions. Now, Padamalla Medical College course MBBS 147 graduates, PG degree and diploma 82 graduates, PhD 1 and super speciality MCH urology 1. Thus total from Padamula Medical College 231 graduates. Then we have uh, from the Medical College, Masters of Physiotherapy, 8 graduates and Bachelor of Physiotherapy, 41 graduates. Then Fathamalla College of Allied Health Sciences, MSc Medical Laboratory Technology, 11 graduates, Masters in Hospital Administration, 23, BSc Medical Laboratory Technology, 31, BSc Medical Imaging Technology, 24, and BSc Radiotherapy 7. Then, Padamala College, Department of Speech and Hearing, Undergraduate Program, Bachelor of Audiology and Speech Language Pathology, we have 32 graduates. Further, Padamala College of Nursing, BSc Nursing, Undergraduate Program, 93 graduates, Post basic BSc Nursing, 51 graduates and postgraduate MSc Nursing, 9 graduates, totally 153. Then we have Padamunna School of Nursing, total diploma holders, 51. Thus, from all our educational institutions, total 615 graduates. Dear friends, these 615 graduates are keen to serve the society and join the healthcare fraternity and we are truly proud of them. Since the starting of the educational institutions, we have never compromised with the quality, ethics, 
and moral principles. That is why we are today proud of these graduates who are at the threshold of serving the society in their respective profession. The qualities that are instilled in their hearts and minds will always stand for them in their future endeavors. They are our true ambassadors hereafter, continuing the mission of heal and comfort, thus continuing the legacy of our founder, Reverend Father Augustus Muller. Father Muller Charitable Institutions is in its 142nd year of fruitful service to the humanity in the area of healthcare. The noble cause of serving the sick, the poor and the needy with an emphasis on service with human touch began in a humble way under a banyan tree in the year 1880. Over these years, this banyan tree has grown with changing times into a gigantic canopy spreading its copious branches far and wide. With a rich and enviable history behind, Father Mullahs has emerged as an institution par excellence in the field of healthcare services and also medical and nursing education. Now, students from all over the world seek admission to various courses, courses offered at Padamulla Charitable Institutions. Walking in the footsteps of our noble founder, Reverend Father Augustus Muller, driven by the catchword, or we can call the mantra, of heal and comfort, we continue to serve the suffering humanity with love and compassion. We have the satisfaction of serving the poorest of poor and it is always called a medical college hospital as poor man's hospital. People come here and also the most sought hospital in the city is Padamulla Medical College Hospital. It is because of our dedication and commitment and the human touch that we give and state of the art facilities and also the nursing care. Uh, for this, people come here and even sometimes for a peaceful death. And this is our mission. We continue this. And for your information, for the last year, for the year ending, we can say that the concession, the free care that we give uh, to these uh, poor people in our medical college hospital is uh, to the tune of 52 crores and that's why uh, we take it as uh, not like a corporate hospital but always we take as a mission to render service to the suffering humanity and this we are uh, committed for this irrespective of religion, caste, creed, language and culture or the state or whatever may be, uh, even sometimes those who are uh, uh, fallen on the roadside, who are known to be looked after and such people especially by uh, the ambulances and that also government service under the they always bring them to father mothers because of the care and the human touch that we give. So with this, I um, um, I have briefed you about our graduation uh, which is to take place in this uh, Homeopathy Medical College will have separate graduation therefore I have not mentioned and that graduation Homeopathy Medical College for your information it will take place on the 14th of uh, May uh, there is still time and uh, because uh, that one teaching called institution like uh, Padamalla Homeopathy Medical College uh, is not included in this it will be later. That is also part of our bottom of the charitable institutions. Thank you. Thank you, Chairman, sir, for the graduation brochure. Um, um, Along with the principles and the for photo. Charitable institutions 
and graduation ceremony 2022, Padamulla Medical College, Padamulla College of Allied Sciences, Padamulla College of Nursing, Padamulla College Department of Speech and Hearing, and Padamulla School of Nursing on April 2nd, 2022 at 10 a.m. venue, Padamulla Convention Centre. I am pleased to uh, unveil or uh, uh, present this to you, uh, to our media and press friends. And the second meeting for the press meeting, I enter the Reverend Father Richard Kershaw School of Bernard Address.